Like we said before, Edius 3D is a preview version. So you can download it and you can use it for nothing. You don't even have to own Edius. Log on to the Grass Valley site, download the trial, use it, it'll work for 30 days and then time out. There are some limitations on the preview version. Obviously the first thing is, it's a preview version. It's not the finished thing. It's not as stable as normal Edius because it's not finished. It's a work in progress. If you start to use it and it crashes more than Edius, don't moan. It's a preview version. If you want a wonderfully stable version, stick with Edius 606 for now and then get Edius 6.5 when it's actually released. You can use Edius 3D on the same computer as normal Edius. You see, I've got both of them here, Edius 6 and Edius 3D. I can't use them both at the same time, but I've been using it like that for ages and it's been working fine. Just be warned that if you do do that, and you have a problem with normal Edius 6 and you go to Grass Valley, they're going to say, sorry, we don't support you. So ideally, if you're going to try out Edius 3D, stick it onto a different computer to your regular editing computer. You'll get less problems that way. With Edius 3D, there's been a considerable change on the filters. So in fact, at the moment, none of the third-party filters will work. All the ProDAD stuff that you get with Edius 6, New Blue Effects, things like VizTitle, do not work in Edius 3D. Now if you've got 606 on the same computer, they'll carry on working in that, but they don't work in Edius 3D at the moment. Edius 3D will only work on Windows 7. Now we recommend Windows 7 64-bit. Edius 3D is not a 64-bit program, it's still a 32-bit program like the normal Edius, but it only works on Windows 7. To be honest, if you haven't changed to Windows 7, you really ought to. It's better. But Edius 6 does officially work on Windows XP as well as Windows 7. Edius 3D is only for Windows 7. There are other new things coming out with Edius 3D. Some of them we don't know what they are. For example, when we go to burn to disk on the current preview version, it pops up with this message. And then we're in the Blu-ray and DVD writing program. There's an extra tab. It's empty. Wonder what that's going to do. Very interesting. Can't wait to find out. Now we'll be giving you more information about Edius 3D and Edius 6.5 over the next few months. Please feel free to sign up for our email newsletter, completely free. We send it out every month or every other month just with the latest rumours and information on it. Um, or pop onto our website where we'll be writing up all this stuff. But it's very exciting, new version of Edius coming along, decent 3D editing and a lot of nice new features included.